Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and I'm going to be doing some art while giving a speech that was on my heart. Um, I wrote it down so it's not off the top of the dome. I wrote down um, exactly what I wanted to say. I hope you guys enjoy it and learn from it. Every day that you live in fear is like slapping God in the face. This fear keeps you from experiencing every wonderful thing that this life has to offer. When you wake up with the ability to hear, to see, speak, and think, that is such a wonderful thing, right? When you have somewhere to live, something to eat, a family, hands, thumbs, pants with pockets, feet with all your toes, I mean, anything like that. Living in fear is not actively recognizing what you have. It's ignoring the fact that life is meant to be lived and enjoyed. Every day that you live in fear or anxiety is a day that you didn't capitalize on the time that you do have here. We're all here for a limited time. If you spend that time in your cube of comfort, fearing everything outside of that cube, you are disrespecting the divinity that is all around you. The fact that this earth has the perfect atmosphere for life, each breath you take, each memory you create by doing something here, something, anything really, you miss out on that because of fear. And I think fear spawns from the need for control. We have to surrender control and leave things to what is and what will be. This earth is powerful. It existed well before us and will continue to exist long after us. There is no need for control. I learned the word nomina, which means a positive, uh, um, which means a positive object or an event that exists independently of human sense and or perception. So this means something can exist without you understanding it. Just because you can't comprehend or understand it doesn't mean it doesn't exist. Learning that word has, I'm, I'm a very logical person, so learning that word has put my logical mind at ease. And I'm so grateful for my logical side, but understanding that there are things that I cannot explain or there are things that are outside of my understanding that, that doesn't mean they don't exist, that, that can still exist. That has helped me tremendously. So it is possible for things to, ex to exist that you cannot understand, perceive, or make sense of. I cannot stress enough that the time that we have here is limited. Living in fear, living with anxiety is, what I heard on the radio is, living in fear is like praying for something bad to happen. So when you're anxious or you're, or you're fearful of something, you are thinking about all the things that can't go wrong it's almost like you're calling them to you and um that was just on my heart to talk about um because i see a lot of people living in fear these days um i drive around for work and um i deliver groceries or you know medicine or whatever people need delivered i deliver it and getting into some of these places is like fort knox and it's like what are you guys so scared of i get that we're in crazy times and i get that things are you know there's some certain uncertainty however we have we can't let that control us we have to take life as it is and what will be will be living in fear is not realizing the divinity around us and that was just my little talk that i had on my spirit and i hope you guys enjoyed it and i hope you have a great day don't forget to like comment subscribe follow my channel this was a short video but it was something that was on my heart i have a bunch of ideas for videos i just have not had the energy like i literally started writing scripts for my videos and once i write the script down i feel like I, i've gotten it off my chest and i don't feel like even making a video about it anymore but you know i do have a bunch of thoughts and a bunch of things i want to talk about um so stay tuned for that thank you for being here